Hey, how's it going, everybody? Welcome to my channel. It's your boy Calvin. Let's get straight to this video. So let's get straight to it. Now, I want to talk about something, and I might dive along several topics, but just bear with me because I think this is a good information just to spread out and you know get some um, reaction about. So I want to talk about enviness on YouTube, and enviness can be anywhere in general it doesn't necessarily have to be about youtube but i definitely find that we are becoming so envious of each other and i don't know what it is but i see it as something that i'm not very used to like because i personally i'm not an envious person i support my friends i support my well wishers my family i try to you know just kind of be free-spirited you know but what I find today is that we are being so accustomed to always wanting. We want better for ourselves, which is good. We want a better car. We want a better house. We want better clothes. You know, better things for ourselves. And I'm not saying that is necessarily bad. But when we see somebody that has one or two of those things, we tend to become envious of that person's success. And because of that, we don't really appreciate what that person has you know gone through to get those success we just sort of like cut them off or become so cold-hearted that we say to ourselves well oh gosh look at so 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 they got this nice car that i wanted and i don't have that and oh man like now he's just bloating you know taking pictures of his car and blah 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 and that might not necessarily be the case but this is our reality you know and this is an example that I'm giving. Like, I like to give examples when I talk about stuff like this because I don't want to just sound like I'm just rambling on. It's funny because sometimes when I post a video or even a short, I might get like three subscribers from that short and maybe additional two from other videos that I have on my channel, which is good. And they'll stay like that for the longest time. But as soon as I post like a community message just to thank my subscribers or, you know, show like a screenshot of how my channel has grown um, the previous month because we do get these stats on our analytics every single month how did your channel do last month compared to this month or you know compared to whatever months whatever the case is we get this every every single month in your email and youtube actually encourages you to take a screenshot of it and thank your community for their support but i find that whenever i do that my subscriber count automatically drops from, let's say, whatever it is, it drops by three or it drops by two. And that is like a steady thing that I noticed always happens whenever I post on my community post, especially if it's a thank you message. And I'm starting to scratch my head and be like, this is so weird because I've been on this platform for the longest time, you know? And back then, Everything was new, especially like with this community tab and stuff like that. And also back then too, the community post was a little bit different because people can actually go on your profile or your YouTube channel and post directly to your community wall of like stuff that whatever comes to mind. It could be things like, oh, you know, keep going, I love the videos, or um, you know, maybe can you do a reaction video to this or you know can you look at this video for me or can you check out my channel can you do this can you do that so you didn't necessarily have to go post in comments to get a reaction people can actually just post them on your wall and then you see them now that stuff is all gone now you are the creator you are the one that's posting you know the the quizzes the polls the message the image polls or whatever the case is and you get a reaction that way and I like both systems, so I'm not saying one is better than the other. But what I'm finding is that I think we've just grown accustomed to just being envious of each other. Because I look at my situation, my example I gave you, I don't know why my channel would like automatically get deducted subs because I'm posting a thank you message. You know what I mean? And I guess that shows that YouTube has changed to where, you know, people that subscribe to you might not necessarily be 
into what you do or you as a creator. And that's okay. But I just find it weird that like, as soon as you make a message to thank your, your viewers, people like automatically like start unsubscribing from you. And it's not even a, a, a negative message. It's actually a positive message. So I don't know what's going on, but this brings me back to my topic of enviousness. You know, I just gave an example in the YouTube terms, right? But this is going on even in the real world. And I'm not saying every situation is good. You might be in a situation that is terrible. You might be in a very rough situation, but I always look at it as to always count your blessings. You know, if you're able to talk to me, to see me, to watch this video, then hey, brother, sister, like whoever you are, you're alive. And that is worth being grateful and thankful for. You know, instead of looking at the things you don't have, I say like, look at the things you do have and you can always work to be better. You can always strive to get that thing that you want and desire. For example, I live in a privileged country where even if you don't have the money to seek higher education, you can get a student loan. Yeah, sure, you have to pay it back after you've done your studies, but you could get that. You could strive for better education and hopefully get yourself out of a situation that you're currently in, you know? And so my point is to be always grateful. As we approach October and all the you know, Vlogtobers that's happening and Thanksgiving if you live in Canada that's happening soon and all the things that we're about to adventure into like after Halloween there is, you know, Christmas and New Year's and so on. I just want to remind everybody to be grateful of your accomplishments, grateful of where you, you're at, grateful of the life you have. You might not have the best life right now but you're in a position where you could seek higher things, you can do things better, you can strive better. You know, I have this this um, canvas painting in my my studio that says, um, "Dream big, work hard." Right? So, dream big, dream of the things that you desire, but know that you might have to work a little bit harder to get those things. Sorry, the lighting just changed, but you know, it's morning. It's like what? 8 a.m. in the morning so I just got to get this video so I'm going to just keep pushing you know and this also brings me back to the YouTube world again right there are two different viewers that go on YouTube there's a casual viewer someone that just logs onto their phone they want to like be entertained want to look at memes and you know comedy or you know, whatever videos they want to look at to just be entertained then there is the content creator we are all in the same boat we are all trying to strive for a reaction, trying to strive for something. I'm posting the videos. Yeah, sure, I'm passionate about my videos, but hey, if I'm doing these videos to get a reaction, I'm doing these videos to get comments, I'm doing these videos to get likes, I'm doing these videos to get a reaction from people, right? Yes, I'm very passionate about them, but I'll be naive to just say like, oh yeah, my passion is the only thing fueling me producing these videos. So if you're a content creator, you're probably doing the same thing as I am. You're posting videos to grow your community, to get a reaction, to get monetized, to make some sort of money and income from making these videos. So knowing that, I think we are losing that sort of supporting each other side of things. You know, where it's like, we're all in the same grind. We're all striving to do something. I'm no different than you. No matter your subscriber count, no matter your success, I'm no different than you. But what I will say is, we should never lose sight of supporting one another. We should never lose sight of just being thankful for our success currently. And we should never lose sight of our goal. You can always get better. You can always improve. Never be in a situation where you feel like there's nowhere you can go from here. Like this is it, you've, you've done it all pretty much because as a drummer i like to think that you can never be the best drummer that you can be there's always room to improve never just be stagnant on like one thing and this is it you know so 
I'm making this video to get the message across. I wish we can just embrace each other and spread love and joy. Because you look at, for example, the conflicts going on in the world, you know, from, I'm not gonna name names because you know, I don't wanna get this video demonetized, but like you look at armed conflicts, you look at struggles that's happening, you know, you look at natural disasters, you look at everything that's, that's going on. And I wish we could go to a place or be at a place where we can be supportive of one another, where we can reach out to each other and you know, offer our help, offer our advice, offer genuine gratitude, genuine appreciation, not just fake stuff, but like be in the moment and be thankful and be appreciative and be supportive of one another. I know I'm being naive here because it's easily said than done, right? I get it. You know, that's a big egg on my face. I get it. But I want to spread this message and hopefully this message resonates with you and hopefully this message spreads the joy and love that I'm hoping comes from watching this video. Anyways, guys, I just got to get this video out because I just had this idea and I'm like, you know what? Someone needs to hear this. I know it's early. I know this is not a drum video. This is not a YouTube necessarily grow tips video. But someone needs to hear this and that might be you. And if this resonates with you, I encourage you to just leave me a comment just to let me know how this resonates with you. Anyways, guys, don't forget to like this video. Peace and love. We're out.